This is the beginning of Hamlet, Act 5, Scene 1. This scene opens up with the gravedigger scene, in which they are remarking that Ophelia is getting Christian burial even though she committed suicide. This is actually a social satire on the classes, because in Shakespeare's time, anyone who committed suicide was thought to be going straight to hell and that they should not be permitted any sort of right. And yet, because Ophelia is rich, she's allowed to get a Christian burial. Another important fact about the Gravediggers is that they're comical relief characters for this part of the play, since up until now it's been pretty much gloom, doom, and lack of spine from Hamlet's actions. This is a build-off, the last scene. Now, Hamlet and Horatio have made their entrance, and the Gravedigger is singing while doing his occupation. He is unfazed at all that he is working with the dead, but Hamlet and Horatio are horrified, more so Hamlet, because he begins to think that the man that he's burying, because Hamlet up to this point has no idea who's died, he could have been a rich man or someone important, and yet here they are that once they're dead they just get eaten by worms. So it's more of analysis for the big picture where regardless of class or how much people owned in their life, Everyone is made of flesh and bones, and both end up the same way as if they were a poor beggar.